So I was talking a little bit earlier about um, the experience of working out and feeling one with my body and how different that is to the experience of feeling dysphoria and feeling constantly disconnected from my body, um, which feels like it's maybe a more common experience for a lot of trans people. And I started thinking about how my sexual traumas also made me feel disconnected from my body and not at one with my body and how even thinking of them or flashing back to them, which happens a lot when I think about them, um, makes me feel disconnected from my body still even though I'm not there anymore. Because <laughs> drama's like that. Um, and with your dysphoria, though, without, in a lot of cases, medical interve intervention, it's not something that goes away. It's a disconnect from your body that you're dealing with constantly. And it is traumatic to feel a disconnect with your body, to feel a disconnect with the sexual part of your body. It's its own kind of trauma that's just constant until you can get medically necessary interventions to help with it. And I hope that can help some people who don't understand dysphoria maybe think about it in a way they haven't thought about it before. But it's something that just clicked for me today. And I wanted people to think about it.